All right, good morning, guys. Uh, my name is Andy. I'm the sales director here at 80 Max, and today I have with me Dr. Jim, uh, Jimmy, our uh, FAE and customer support specialist as well. Um, well, thank you, guys, uh, have a, for joining us today. Uh, good morning, everyone. Today, um, our agenda is basically really have you walk away, you know, um, knowing you know, who is 80 Max, what we do and uh, why should you partner with uh, AD Max? And I'll turn it over to Jimmy, and um, go ahead, Jimmy. Okay, welcome everyone. Before we begin, I will go over some background information about Edimax. Then you all will get to see some of our innovative products and the different features. Afterwards, I will go into our ADMX Pro Series and a different top applications for use. In addition, I will talk about a few cases and how we are able to provide solutions for those scenarios. In the end, I will wrap it up with a brief summary and try to answer any questions that you all may have. ADMX was started in 1986, and since our establishment, we have grown to be amongst the world leaders in providing advanced networking solutions. Edimax technology is dedicated to the design, development, manufacture, and marketing of a broad range of networking solutions. With over 30 years of experience in the networking industry, Edimax has now become one of the top ODM slash OEM companies in Asia. In 2001, we had our first initial public offering, and currently we have over 2,500 plus employees worldwide. Can everybody see the screen now? Oh. Okay, sorry about that. Edimax was started in 1986. And so since our establishment, we have grown to be amongst the world leaders in providing advanced networking solutions. So what is our mission here at Edimax? It is simple. Networking people together. How are we doing this? We do this by providing a broad range of affordable networking solutions for consumers and small to medium sized businesses. And why are we doing this? We do this to keep people staying connected. Whether you have a loved one across the world or talking with a colleague overseas, staying connected has become part of our daily lives. Edimax was built on the core values of innovation, R&D, quality service, and integrity. We are committed to provide the latest networking technologies to our customers at affordable prices. Here at Edimax, we are constantly investing into our R&D department, which has over 300 engineers and over 12 years of experience. The result of these investments has won us numerous innovation awards. In addition, we have proven ourselves to be one of the top manufacturers in the networking industry through our quality servers and partnership with our channel members. Furthermore, the reason why we have become so successful is because we are a customer-oriented company. We not only manufacture products for the Soho slash SMB markets, but also enable our channel partners to provide complete networking solutions for large businesses. We actively listen to our customers' needs and concerns and work diligently to resolve their issues in a timely manner. NMX Technology is headquartered in Taipei, Taiwan, and over the years we have established over 20 branch offices worldwide. There are over 75 countries that carry the NMX footprint. With our global expansion, NMX has now spanned across four continents. NMX is a true manufacturer, which means we design, manufacture everything in-house. The advantage of being a true manufacturer is that it allows us to quickly adapt to the new technologies. By closely monitoring and by closely monitoring the marketing trends, we are able to adapt quickly to the demands of the market. In addition, we can quickly change or alter our products to fit the needs of our customers. 
all of our products carry a two-year limited warranty with the exception of our Edamax Pro Series that has a limited lifetime warranty. By staying ahead of the curve, we offer a full range of solutions for, our, for the consumer and enterprise markets. In 2010, we were rated as number one in customer satisfaction and performance by PC, PC Pro in the UK. So with a brand and product that users can trust, customers will feel satisfied when choosing Edamax. Since our establishment in 1986, Edamax has been constantly growing and expanding. Currently, our USB adopters dominate about 30% of the global market share. For 15 years in a row, we have won the Taiwanese Excellent Award. Edamax is now ranked top 35 most valuable international Taiwanese brand for two consecutive years by Interbrand in 2015. Here are some of our innovative products. In 2011, we released the world's smallest USB adapter. In 2012, we released the world's smallest Wi-Fi extender. Also in that year, we released the easy three-step installation process for our IP cameras, making it easy for users who are not familiar with setting up an IP camera. And also in 2013, we released the world's first 11AC USB 3.0 adapter. Additionally, in that year, we also released the world's smallest travel router. In 2014, we broke our previous record and released the world's smallest Wi-Fi range extender as well as a dual band range extender. Also in that year, we released a seamless ceiling mount access point and the world's first 5G upgrader. With the affordable and stylish design, users can upgrade their home router with the 5 gigahertz add-on station. Just select AP mode and connect to your router slash switch to upgrade your network to 5 gigahertz. In addition, users can also upgrade their home for more convenience with the Edamax smart plug that can either set up a daily schedule or remotely power on and off their devices. And next we have our AC 1200 dual band router that has five modes in one. It can be used as a router, a range extender, a bridge, an access point, or a WISP mode. Here we have some of our best-selling USB adapters. The EW7811UN you see here is an N150 nano USB adapter, one of the top sellers on Amazon. We also have 2.4 GHz adapters and also 5 GHz adapters and dual band, adap uh, dual band adapters. For users with Windows 10, they can simply plug and play to connect to their wireless network. In addition, all of our adapters can support earlier versions of Windows, Mac, and Linux operating systems with the correct driver. Next we have here is some of our wireless broadband routers. The BR6258NL is the world's smallest travel router and personal hotspot. So in case you're at a hotel, you can use the travel router to connect to the hotel's network and broadcast a secure wireless connection. Edamax routers features a smart IQ setup with no CD required from any smartphone, iPad, or tablet or PC and set up within minutes. All of our routers are multi-function, so you can use it either as a router, an access point, or a range extender. And depending on the model, you can also use it as a bridge or a WISP. This provides more flexibility, less inventory, and better cash flow for our resellers by providing all-in-one solutions. Home surveillance systems have become more popular over the years due to home security. Edamax provides a range of IP cameras for those purposes. With the EDVO2 app, users can set up their camera with three easy steps. Simply join to the camera's Wi-Fi SSID, open the app, and then select your network to join. Afterwards, they can use the EDVO2 app for a live view or use a web-based cloud ID to monitor their devices. We have cameras for both indoor and outdoor environments. All of our cameras have a motion detection region so you can set up an area you want to be triggered. Once it is triggered, it can be set up to notify you on your phone, your email, or save it to an SD card. So in case you're at work or away, you can easily monitor your home with Edimax IP cameras. The first camera you see here features a motorized pan and tilt view, two-way audio, and acoustic echo noise cancellation. 
Then we have our outdoor camera with a 139 degree wide angle view that includes an outdoor, uh, that includes an indoor Wi-Fi unit that supports passive PoE. Our latest camera has a fish eye lens, full 1080p with a 100 degree panoramic view. Now we will get into our Edimax Pro series, designed for small offices, home offices, and small to medium sized businesses. The Edimax Pro series is a range of high performance, reliable, and affordable networking solutions for modern businesses that demand high speeds, such as schools, hotels, hospitals, and more. With today's demand for security, flexibility, and speed, the Edimax Pro series has a wide range of potential applications for those environments. It supports high density capacity for up to 100 concurrent clients, ideal for bringing your own device workplaces. With adjustable radio frequency and output power, the high receiver sensitivity, EDMX process points are equipped to provide wide coverage where it's needed the most. Suitable for large spaces across office floors, shop floors, hospital wards, or conference rooms, by providing wireless coverage that staff and systems need to operate efficiently. So why expand your business with the EDMAX Pro Series? Businesses can expand their current infrastructure with the easy deployment and affordable solutions. The latest IEE 802.11 AC standard wireless technology delivers the gigafast Wi-Fi speeds that today's fast-moving modern businesses and environments demand. With simultaneous 2.4 and 5 gigahertz dual-band coverage, this means maximum flexibility for mobile-centric business applications reaching concurrent speeds up to 450 megabits per second on the 2.4 band and 1300 megabits per second on the 5 gigahertz band. So it can handle the most bandwidth intensive tasks for audio, video, and voice applications. All of the EDMX Pro series are pre-installed with the web-based interface, the network management suite, for centralized and easy management. Each access point has several operation modes. AP mode, manage AP mode, and controller AP mode. And lastly, repeater mode. The only exception is the OAP, which does not have a controller mode since it's an outdoor unit. To use the NMS software, assign one AP to be the controller, which is the master, and then assign the other APs in manage AP mode, which is a slave. One AP controller can manage up to eight APs. While in Manage AP mode, all settings will be grayed out and needs to be set on the Controller AP. The NMS suite includes a dashboard view, map view, traffic statistics, rogue AP detection, and wireless client list for network-wide remote administration. Zone plans can also be set up through the wizard and are also available for expanding and managing large networks with multiple access points. Manage radius settings, wireless LAN settings, access control, guest network settings and firmware upgrades from a single location to reduce network downtime and also aid troubleshooting and optimize network performance. First we have the affordable entry level CAP 300, a single band 2x2 2.4 gigahertz 802.11n wireless AP ceiling mount with speeds up to 300 megabits per second. It's designed for high density usage and supports up to 16 multiple SSIDs for security. EDMX Pro access points can also extend coverage 1.5 times greater than typical APs and supports powered over Ethernet for easy and flexible installation. Next we have the CAP1200, a dual band 2x2 802.11 AC wireless AP seating mount with concurrent speeds up to 1200 megabits per second. It is the world's first cinema sleeting mount and is designed with a flame retarded plastic housing. It is the winner of the 2014 Taiwanese Excellence Award and the ICT Month Innovative Elite Golden Award. Like all of our EDMX Pro access points, it supports power over Ethernet for easy and flexible installation. It can support up to 32 SSIDs, 16 for the 2.4 band and 16 for the 5 gigahertz band. The CAP1200 uses a MediaTek 7620 chipset for the 2.4 frequency and a Qualcomm 9882 chipset for the 5 gigahertz frequency. 
Additionally, EDMX Pro Series features high-performance design, such as solid capacitors, capacitors for significantly longer lifespans than traditional non-solid alternatives, generating less heat and delivering increased stability. The hardware is durable, robust, and backed with a limited lifetime warranty ready for business environments. Next, we have the WAP-1200, a 2x2802-11C dual-band wireless AP wall mount. The WAP-1200 is qu equipped with a detachable external antenna for water coverage and a higher sensitivity. With the smart handoff feature, users can set the sensitivity level to automatically switch over to other APs for seamless connectivity and no interruptions. It also includes a magnetic and wall mounting bracket to fixate your WAP on a wall to use as an X point repeater in managed AP mode or controller AP mode. We also offer an additional security cover to protect the WAP from theft and dust. Next we have the CAP1750, a 3x3802.11ac dual band ceiling mount access point. It uses a 4.3 dBi internal antenna for the 2.4 band and a 5.3 dBi internal antenna for the 5 gigahertz band. With concurrent speeds up to 1750 megabits per, seven megabits per second, ideal for environments that, that demand faster speeds. In addition, the back housing is also made with a solid metal which acts as a heat sink for cooling. Next, we have the WAP1750 a 3x3802.11ac dual band wall mount access point. Like all of our EDMX Pro Series access points, it has a built-in radius server that supports up to 256 users. In addition, all of our EDMX Pro access points have several operation modes, so they can all be managed through the NMS software that is built in. So for AP modes to be managed, they need to be set to a managed AP mode. So this means you will need to log into the AP controller to adjust the settings. Since the settings in a managed AP mode will be grayed out, the WAP also supports IEE 802.3 PoE in and also IEE 802.3 PoE out. So you, you can use a second LAN port to power on an additional IP camera. The WAP uses a Qualcomm 95A8 chipset for the 2.4 GHz band and a Qualcomm 9882 chipset for the 5 gigahertz band. The wall-mounted design and additional grade build quality combined with user-friendly operation and an extensive feature set makes an ideal high-performance dual-band solution for demanding businesses' operations. For our outdoor environment, we have the OAP1750, a 3x3 dual-band AC1750. It is built with a rugged construction built to survive the most challenging environments. It is made with a die-cast aluminum housing for weatherproof, dustproof, and corrosion resistance. The premium outdoor solution will provide coverage where you need it the most with the super high-speed AC1750. Next, we have the GS5424 PLG, a web smart manifold switch with 24 gigabit ports and four SFP slots, so it can support up to 30 watts of power per port with a 400 watt total power budget. Security and management features include bandwidth control, VLAN, using the web interface, and administrators can also set up VLAN to segregate traffic and configure link, link aggregation settings to create a big traffic pipelines. Last, we have the APC500 a dedicated controller unit managing up to 30 added EDMX Pro access points. With a built-in radius server and built-in NMS, the APC500 can securely manage EDMX Pro access points. It also supports guest access and captive portal, which supports user's name and password-based authentication with independent guest network settings for bandwidth rates, IP filtering, duration of use, and an easy front desk system for account genera generation and ticketing. So here is an example of our enterprise that requires Wi-Fi coverage in the parking lot and between buildings. 
we have an outdoor access point installed on the top of each building set in managed AP mode. A controller is used to control all the managed AP modes. The APC 500 installed here you see is to control all managed AP modes. And it also supports cat the portal and guest access. So administrators can separate each SSID by the VLAN tag for better security. The second or third building can either be set as a standalone AP or repeater mode. So for companies who already have a SNMP software, they can set the operation modes as AP. Now we will go over a few cases on how our Edimax Pro series can provide solutions depending on the requirements of each establishment. The first case we have here is TC Sakura, a good quality community in Taipei City that has won numerous awards. They require enhanced Wi-Fi signal to stability and solve the issue that mobile phones has no signal in the ground parking lot. They also require Wi-Fi to minimize wire cabling. And so to solve their issue, we installed 10 cap 1200s and 27 cap 300s. In this case, all the APs are powered by a PoE switch. When installing the APs, we set the RSI SSI thresholds so that we can enable smart handover for fast roaming and seamless connectivity in the underground parking lot. So for locations that have a no signal or a weak signal, businesses can solve their problem by installing access points for reliable coverage. When setting up all the APs, each area was tested for the weakest signal and so that we can choose a channel with the less inter interference. The next case we have is Omen Cutlery. They specialize in producing fully forged and hollow hand knives. The requirements they had were enhanced Wi-Fi coverage, reliable fast roaming, and easy installation with centralized management. For this setup, we use one GS5424POG and one GS1008PO and 18 cap 1200s managed by the SNMP software that the company provided. The next case we have here is Howard Beach Resort Kenting, which is a, lux a luxurious five-star hotel. This business required 800 devices to be accessed at the same time. They require 11 AC signal without dead zones, using PUE power, guest network isolation, policy-based traffic shaping, and managed by their central computer with SNMP software. For this setup, we use two 24-port web smart switches, 15 cap 1200s, and one WAP1750. Each conference room has a CAP1200 installed. The WAP1750 is installed in the lobby, and the rest were installed in the grand bar room. All are powered via the PoE switch, so IT managers can create the multiple SSIDs and VLAN tagging for guest network isolation and secure management through bandwidth control. The last case we have is Stain Stainless Steel. They were established in 1980 and are now one of the market leaders in refined stainless steel. They require 11 AC speeds and seamless connectivity through the whole warehouse. We installed three CAP 1200s and set the RSSI thresholds so that users can enjoy seamless connectivity throughout the whole warehouse without any interruption or downtime. Everything is managed from a central computer with the SNMP software. So here's a brief summary of our Edamax Pro series, ranging from our entry-level CAP300 to our CAP1750 and our WAP1750. These access points have several operation modes, AP mode, managed AP mode, controller AP mode, 
and repeat mode. They can all be managed with a dedicated controller unit. When using, when using this mode, the access points need to be set in the managed AP mode. So with the latest 802.11ac standard, businesses can enjoy gigabit speeds and affordable prices with reliability and security. When performance and security are critical for businesses, they need products and, that are engineered for the industry. The Edimax Pro series is designed to help businesses provide connectivity that they rely on every day with safety and effectiveness guaranteed. So if you all have any questions about the Edimax Pro series, uh, I would like to answer them now. And you can type it into the ch uh, chat box so we can see what, que what type of questions that you may have. If there are any questions that you may have, All right, so um, the first question uh, we're going to take is from Baker, Matt Baker. So um, the management software uh, provided by AD Max. So basically, uh, we currently, it's uh, embedded uh, MMS uh, software. So basically, we do not charge any licensing fee. Um, and uh, there's no additional CD or there's no dedicated server or desktop that are required. The automatic it's uh, preloaded in the firmware uh, of the AP itself. Now, standalone, we can manage up to eight access points. Uh, it's mixed and matched, so it doesn't matter what model you actually need to um, buy. So whether you buy, uh, you know, three of the CAP 300, three of the CAP 1200, three of the CAP 1750, it doesn't really matter. And then you make one of them uh, dedicated uh, uh, master and then rest of the eight uh, the slaves. Now we do also have special firmware that you can load it onto the controller itself and you can manage up to 16 uh, access points or so additional eight. Um, however the master itself will not be functioning as the AP anymore. Uh, if you need any more than that we also have a uh, standalone dedicated uh, controller where you can manage up to 32 uh, access points. Okay, so hopefully that answers your question. Um, second question is from Joe. And um, the question is how close are we with Qualcomm? Well, um, we actually have a really good relationship with uh, most of the chipset uh, manufacturer, except maybe uh, Broadcom. So the reason being is we're actually one of the top five uh, tier one ODM OEM for networking in the world. Okay, um, right now if you go walk into Fry's or Best Buy, about 45 to 55 percent of the product on the shelf already have AD Max inside. So most of the tier one brand in the U.S. except maybe Nick here is actually all of our uh, customer. So maybe um, you know we some of the products we use Realtek, MediaTek, and some product we use Qualcomm. It just depends on what our customer prefer. Um, so we have a pretty close relationship with most of the major uh, chips that manufacture. Okay, so next question. It's by Lewis Welvium. So 
So the CAP300 is uh, a 2 by 2 It is uh, two stream, uh, but only function on the 2.4 gigahertz. Not sure if that answers your question. And John, uh, the next question, um, do we carry a 48-port PoE switch? So uh, we actually had a 48-port PoE switch. It just got recently got phased out. We are looking to release a version 2. So in the meantime, the highest we currently carry only a 24-port PoE switch on the 80 Max Pro. Um, the older one was not uh, part of the 80 Max Pro family, so we phased it out. Um, and we're looking to bring back another 48 port into the 80 Max Pro uh, family series. Okay. Okay. And the next question is actually by Michael. Um, his question is uh, if we can run it through the management piece one more time. So we will go ahead and do that. Uh, have Jimmy uh, go through the management piece of it uh, one more time uh, towards the end. Uh, we're going to try to answer some of the more uh, questions first. Okay, the next question is some uh, request from Michael. Um, so, Jimmy, can you go back to the uh, customer satisfaction slide? I guess um, you'd like to see the slide once more. And uh, we also have a question just came from Jason Gate. Um, so are our product uh, licensed to use uh, worldwide? Uh, the answer is yes. Uh, most of you, I see that most of your customers are um, worldwide customer. However, you are specifically asking Japan. So um, actually, some of our products we cannot actually sell in Japan because we have one of our largest uh, ODM OEM customers in Japan where uh, there might be some conflict of interest, but that depends on the product line. Um, so we can take this offline uh, if you have a particular item that you're looking uh, to get into Japan, um, let us know and I can def definitely double check that and see if we actually like to uh, sell in Japan on that pro particular product. Uh, there's also just a new question just came in from Lou Wilson. Um, yes, so we also have our uh, FAE that can actually guide you through the uh, network design and if you have, ever have a need for it. And also they can help you walk through the network, um, load the network diagram onto the uh, access point uh, MMS controller. There's a question from Max. Um, so you're asking to see if there's any scenario for auto coverage um, or any other projects uh, for the outdoor. Um, currently, 
we are working with a uh, uh, golf course. Um, however, that's still a um, uh, project in progress because we just released the uh, OAP series, the Outdoor Access Point. We currently have two models, so we barely launched this outdoor line uh, for about two, maybe three months. So, I, so far, our marketing department has not put it together uh, case scenarios, uh, but based on my knowledge, we are currently working with one of the uh, golf course uh, for the outdoor OAP. So once that's done, we will upload that into uh, our uh, case study section and also our uh, uh, website. Okay. So go ahead, Jim, uh, Jimmy, go over the um, OAP 1750 slide again, and also then we'll go over the management piece of it. Um, I think there's some question uh, that how do we follow up with you offline? Um, feel free to shoot us an uh, email at sales at admax.com, and, um, or you can shoot uh, an email directly to me at Andy, A-N-D-Y, at abmax, E-D-I-M-A-X dot com. So, right, so, okay, so running over the uh, network management suite, it's a built-in network management suite, so all the access points can be set up as a managed AP controller or controller AP mode. So when you set it as a controller AP mode, that's, this will be the master unit. It can control up to eight managed APs, and uh, when using the controller mode and a, uh, manage AP mode, uh, you, keep, you have to keep in mind that when the access points are in manage AP mode, all the settings will be grayed out. So you have to set the uh, settings in the controller AP mode. So that, that way, when it's in the controller AP mode, uh, you can use all your settings. Uh, you can look up your devices. Uh, each access point can be configured individually. Uh, we also have a group batch function, so for example, if you need to upgrade the firmwares for all of the APs, uh, you can do that on the controller AP so that uh, you can reduce network downtime. Uh, for the uh, network management suite, uh, it's uh, built in, so you don't need to download any software. Uh, just select it as a controller AP mode, and you will see the uh, dashboard view when you log into the unit. And so for our outdoor access point, uh, there's three modes that you can choose. You can choose manage AP mode, AP mode, or repeater mode. So uh, given the uh, range for the outdoor access point, uh, we tend to, uh, if it's a clear line of sight, um, users can probably get a range of about uh, seven to 800 feet, uh, maybe more depending on their environment. Uh, so when choosing and uh, when doing the outdoor setup, uh, we recommend users to set up the equipment first, and then that way they can uh, have the second unit in, the, in a different area, and so that the way they can make sure that they have the wireless connection. There's a new question from John. Is there a firewall solution in the ADMAX Pro line? Uh, currently, we do not have any uh, uh, firewall uh, solution under the ADMAX Pro line, uh, but we are looking to that. Um, but currently, under ADMAX, we do not have that solution. And um, from Hayden um, Blair, so the question is, 
Do we currently have any other residential grade AP? We do, um, our Wi-Fi routers. Uh, if you go to our um, admax.com and go under the Soho section, uh, you will see uh, residential grade uh, both router and AP. So if you're interested in just a residential grade uh, radio, we do have that option there. Um, so when the next question from David, um, when will the outdoor AC products be available? Um, so they will actually start shipping uh, May 1st. Um, right now we just got the first batch, so um, so it's like a running release. So a tr uh, our official launch will be May 1st. So the uh, with the new question from Matt like uh, Baker, there's a question about, regarding the controller box. Uh, does it support captive portal? Um, on the APC 500, it does support captive portal. I will double check on the marketing um, material and the product description and see if um, we missed that uh, features on there. So if you do hotel install it does support um, uh, capital portal. Correct. So um, the on the slide it does show capital portal and uh, it is one of the features in the uh, APC 500. Uh, can, you, can you please go back to APC 500 slide? Yeah, so as you can see on this slide uh, Captain Porto is one of the uh, number one feature on there. All right, so hopefully that answers your questions. So one last thing before we uh, end the uh, webinar. Um, one thing I want to encourage you guys to check out the uh, Streetwave uh, website. And under the reseller section, uh, I encourage you guys to sign up as uh, our MVP partner. So we actually just came up with this new and revised uh, bar partner program, where is our new uh, loyalty program. Okay, for the past 12 months, we have gotten a lot of feedback, such as you know, make it easy, make it simple. Um, you know, can you add this benefit? So let me understand how to make money. So we have lessons and we have uh, recreated our bar program, which is called the MVP program, our most valued partner program today, okay? Uh, feel free to check it out. Um, and we wrote a program, you know, we believe in one thing, where is consistency, okay? We want you to know quarter after quarter, this program is gonna be in place and it's gonna be the same, okay? This is about being consistent and predictable. You know what's coming and you know you can count on it and you know exactly how much discount you're gonna get and how much money you're gonna make, okay? So we have made all the adjustment, all the uh, back-end rebate has become the front-end now, okay? So when you buy through Streetway, you're automatically getting that uh, front-end, you know, whether it be 8%, 10%, or 12% discount, depends on your partnership tier, okay? So we will not change this uh, going forward. We'll make smaller, uh, adjustment, tweaks and fix, maybe adding more uh, benefit to it, but we believe longevity is the cons uh, consistency and you'll continue to see that from us, okay? So please take us sometimes and check out the reseller um, program on the uh, street website, okay? Um, so I think that's it for uh, today's webinar. I thank you partners who has been with us for a long time. I thank you partners who have been selling and recommending AD Max to your customers. And I thank you partners who have just started doing business with us. And if you have not, this is your time to decide. And I hope I, we showed you that we can be a trusted manufacturer and we want to play a big role in your business. I guess the last thing I wish to say to you is I wish you all good luck as this is the time for networking business. And we are very bullish as you can tell. Uh, this is a great opportunity to tell the ADMAX story. So please think of us when you're recommending networking equipment to your customers and 
know that we will bring the best product and technology to the industry. I look forward to have the opportunity to continue to talk to uh, each one of you, and I thank you for your business, and I thank you for thinking about ADMAC and spending time with us, and I'll talk to you all of you soon. Have a great, guys. Good.